Hello, it's Francine Chirambo, Relationship Coach. Do you ever attend weddings? Or have you attended any wedding lately? I was just wondering. I see a lot of weddings. I see a lot of people getting married. And the ones getting married are the ones that I want to address today. There was a time um, a while ago, I posted something on a father handing over his child to the groom who's supposed to be the husband. I always wonder whether the young men or even the old men that have been married for a while really understand what it means. You know, do you understand that moment where a father actually walks his child uh, down the aisle and goes ahead to give away his child? I don't think a lot of people understand this important moment. At this moment, the father is saying, I'm walking down the aisle and um, this is my child who I have taken care of. This is my child who I have loved so dearly. And I'm giving away my headship over this child. I am giving away this child to you. I have been a father. I have been a provider. I have been a protector. I have been a leader. I have been everything that I can be as a father. And he hands over his child to you, the groom. You take this child and I think you are really blank in your head. You're not really understanding what this man is saying. Do you actually see that some fathers actually, some fathers cry as they hand over their child to you? They cry because they are not sure you're going to be the father that he has been to this child. Basically, what you are taking over from him is the button. Uh, in a relay, we see people handing over the button. You know, the first person starts, goes over to the next one and goes over to the next one. And during a wedding ceremony, this is exactly what is happening. The father hands over his child to you and he's saying, take over where I'm living from. But the sad part is a lot of people are not understanding this. You're taking over and you simply dump the child and it's not right. What I'm saying is that if you are not sure of what you are taking over, step back, leave that child alone until such a time when you are ready to be the provider, the protector, the leader, and everything else that a husband is supposed to be. Let's talk some loving next time. Bye-bye.